All right. In this video, we'll learn to use the ScreenPal screen recorder. So, let's get into it. First, let's download the app from the website. To download it, click on the button. The download should start automatically. When it's installed, the app will open. All right. This is the program. The free version supports 15 minutes max recording. We can drag from the corners to adjust the recording canvas. You can also set the canvas size here and adjust the position. The active window will adjust the size with the active window. Let's open Google Chrome. Now if I choose active window, it will auto adjust the canvas size. The last one is full screen. Narration is your mic. You can choose your mic from here. When you do, this panel will display to test your mic. You can adjust the settings here or click on this button to automatically adjust the mic's volume. We can't record the computer sound for free. You can just record the webcam by clicking here and then selecting your webcam from here. If you see this, let it download the file. ScreenPal lets you set the background. You can choose blur or any of those images. It's not the best, but it works. You can also choose your own image. Mirroring your camera is possible and if you have a green screen, click here to adjust the settings. You can also record both. This will add a small camera box which can be extended with this button. Those will shrink it back. You can change the camera or adjust the same settings from here. Let's go back to the screen only. To close and open settings, click here. This on the top is the drawing toolbar. It's handy for explaining things. This settings button goes to the keyboard shortcuts. Alright, let's hit record. When the recording starts, you will see this timer and the stop button. Everything is being recorded now. You can choose a pen and start drawing. It also has this highlighter. This eraser will erase your drawn stuff. Next is the text box. If you click on it again, you will see this settings panel. Those tools also have these settings. You can change the color and thickness. Let's disable the background and change the font. Draw a box and we can now type in this box. It also has some shapes. We can change the color and thickness. This zoom feature will zoom in on the screen when you double click. The reset zoom option is here. In the drawing mode, you can right click to see more options. To finish the recording, click on the blue button. You can play the whole recording here. ScreenPal does not support continue recording for free. So recording a new video will delete this if you don't save it. When you click here, you will have two options. You can directly save this video or edit it. We'll open the editor. We don't have many options, but the app lets you play and trim the video. You can also request free music. There are some categories and you can click here to play audio before importing. To import it, click on this check mark. It will download the track from the internet. You can also add captions from a file for free. The app supports uploading to YouTube, but you must sign in. I'll save the video by clicking on this button. You can set the video format, but I'll leave it to MP4. I'll save the video on the desktop. This highlight cursor feature lets you disable the cursor completely, show the plan cursor, or highlight the cursor with this yellow circle. Once all set, click on this publish button. So here's our video now. Let's play it. There's no watermark which is great as most recorders have a watermark. ScreenPal lets you upload this video and share a link with others. You will need to create an account for that. For now this is it. Thanks for watching. Please let me know if you need any help or want more information about the premium plan. Take care.